All right, so this guy, a um, couple things. One, this came from the same place that the Gizmo figure did. Um, so it's, unlike the Gizmo figure, this one is used. Um, I bought this used. Everything came in it. Um, I kind of peeked in and made sure, but this is the first time that I'm really, uh, that I'm really opening it and taking it out of its packaging. Um, this is going to be a two-part video, so I'm going to do the box and unboxing it, and then I'll do an actual review of the figure itself. Um, the other thing is the box is definitely not in mint condition. Uh, because A, it was used, and B, whenever we got it home, my girlfriend stepped on it. So, but fortunately, we won't be needing this to open it, because, like I said, it's used and it's already been opened a couple times. So, uh, first things first, let's, oh well, okay, yeah. Uh, first off, I want to dedicate this video to uh, Chachi Power. Uh, he has two channels, Chachi Power and uh, Rocket Punch Army. He also does videos for Collection DX. Um, I've been watching your videos for a long time. I like them. I dig them. They're cool. Um, they're m making me not so much change my views, but it's definitely making me appreciate older toys, um, die cast. I still hate vinyls. I'm never going to like them, but maybe. <laughs> we'll see. Um, but yeah, I really like your channels and what little notoriety that you've given me. I really appreciate whenever you made that first video with the glowy, the glowiness. And, uh, yeah. Definitely gonna keep watching. Um, so this first, this video is dedicated to you. But, anyways. So let's go ahead and start off with the price. Um, not sure what the price normally is. Um, I got 25 for this. And it was a Christmas special, so it was actually like 25% off with the gizmo. Really wasn't that bad of a price. But, uh... So you can see this is the Robot Spirits Double uh, O Gundam O Gundam from the end of Season 2 and technically the beginning of Season 1. Um, it's got the official Double O Gundam logo right there, which uh, also appears on all their model kits. Um, let's see if I can get one really quick. Okay, so I don't have any lying around right now, so I won't worry about it. I'm not going to waste my time looking. Anyways, uh, yeah, so that's official logo. Uh, this is number 22 in the line. Uh, let's see here. G-N-O-O-O. -O, o Gundam. Bandai. Choking Hazard. Small parts. Blah, blah, blah. All that good stuff. Got a... Here's the figure inside. Doesn't come with very many accessories, which is why it was so cheap. Um, it's depressing to an extent. Oh, wow, hit the camera. Okay, so here's the side. Nice. I'm sure it was a nice box at one time. I've still never figured out if these are computer-generated mock-ups of how it should look, or I don't think this is the real figure at all. It's Japanese writing. Caution, please handle with care and store out of reach of children younger than 15 years old. That's weird. The front it says under 3, and here it's saying 15. So. So, yeah. Um, more of, you know, adult collectible type toy. It's not really a kid's model kit. If they really wanted that, they could build, I don't know, an SD. Speaking of SDs, snap! Double O Quanta, yeah, look at that. Work in progress, but good work in progress, if I do say so myself. I just did. But yeah, anyways, enough of that. Um, speaking of Quanta, yeah, another work in progress. Okay, anyways, enough of that. That's really silly. Waste time. Okay, so let's go ahead and crack open the already cracked open and torn up box. So it comes in this tray and then this little instruction sheet paper. It's got where you put the beam saber, how all that works, GN 
backpack and then the replacement and then it came with both hard and soft plastic like it's got a very malleable plastic for these parts that stick up on its chest um, nothing on the back which you can see these might be the soft ones um, but um, you can exchange those out and then here's the two backpacks that actually go right there that comes with the shield little GN gun and then exchangeable hands and you can see none of that's being held in there very well because the tape was all gone and then it's got the beam cipher so let's go ahead and open this up and we'll take the figure out we'll stand him up now I'm not really sure how much of him is but I know for sure that parts of him are really heavy compared to a normal toy. Um, it's definitely got some die cast in him in some places. Um, I will figure out where that is whenever I do the review. Um, yeah, these are the soft parts, so the hard parts are what's still in here. See that really quick. See that doesn't. I mean, it bends, but no more than a normal piece of plastic would. But I will upload the video of the full review as soon as I'm finished. So see ya. Say bye, Double O Gundam. I guess that counts. Revision. Say bye, O Gundam, not Double O. It's the same bye. Okay, whatever. That's fine too.